Hello, everyone. Thanks for joining my channel, RP Guru Tech Talk. This is Renu Prasad. Uh, if you have not subscribed to my channel, please do subscribe uh, to watch uh, more fun videos and also um, get updated when new videos are uploaded in my channel. Thank you so much. Let us say we want to uh, um, copy some text from other documents and uh, make a note of it in our document. So what we do is let's say, let's take this example here, uh, this uh, troubleshooting guide I have. So I want to copy this text, let's say up to here. And uh, I'm going to do a control C. And then uh, I go here to my empty word document. I paste it here. So I want the, I want something else in that document. So I go down, go down a bit and copy uh, this text uh, to my, I do a control C again and I go back to my word document and do a control V, right? So to do, so if you see, uh, basically it's pretty tedious uh, to go about copying each and every text you want and uh, go to the document, uh, take that text. You don't know uh, whether you copied the previous one, stuff like that. So it's pretty tedious, but uh, I'm not sure if you've uh, heard the features of clipboard in Windows 10. Uh, one of the features of clipboard is, uh, see if you saw that, uh, it copied, I copied two separate text uh, information from this document and pasted it into a Word document uh, with a control, with, I copied with a control C uh, each of those items and did a control V on my um, Word document. So there's one more amazing feature of clipboard. So let me show you. Instead of hitting control V, hit the Windows uh, button and V. And it pops up all the text uh, you had copied uh, in the clipboard. So this is, in fact, now you can selectively, once you've copied everything here, uh, you can actually uh, start pasting uh, the text you want. So you can see that uh, basically. So if you do a control V, it pastes the last text. If you do Windows V, it pops up the screen, which has all the clipboard items you have. So let's go back uh, before I sh um, uh, show you some more features of clipboard. Let's go back to my text, uh, the tech file, which I uh, had opened to show you this demo. So I'm going to say, without going back to the Word document, I'm going to copy this, Control C, then I'm going to copy this, Control C, and I keep going. I'm not going to go back to my Word document yet. Um, Control C. And this is just a text uh, demo I'm showing you. You can actually copy pictures. You can actually copy um, anything you want. Uh, as long as it's less than four MB, uh, four megabytes, you should be able to, uh, the clipboard keeps track of that item. So let's say I want to copy this one, right? I'm going to see snipping tool. Um, I'm going to use snipping tool for this. And I'm going to say, uh, do control announce there. So then let's go back to my Word document. I hit Windows V. You can see it has my picture I just copied. It has all the text I want, uh, which I have just copied from the other document. So I can selectively um, pick any of these in, and paste it in my document. So. Let's say I want to paste the picture. I just double click that. I'm just click that once to uh, paste that information. So one more feature of uh, the clipboard is uh, if you do a, a Windows V, um, whenever you um, reboot your system uh, or log out from the system, all these clipboard items will be cleared out from your clipboard. But there's another feature which, where you want to uh, keep it in the clipboard even though you reboot your system. That is the option here is you use something called pin. When you click on pin, the next time you reboot, your clipboard will still contain this item which you had copied before rebooting. So that is one more feature. And the other feature is you can do, um, you can delete each and every item you want or just do a clear all. So your clipboard uh, empties out. So uh, I hope you like the video and I hope you use these features 
uh, for your future uh, requirements. Uh, thanks for watching. Talk to you soon.